I want to propose tonight that given the depth of the challenges we have and how fast and profoundly the world is changing, there's very little or no space for what we all have come to know as corporate social investment. So we have carefully considered the needs of our communities and the direction in which the world is moving against our capacity as a business. We've made careful choices about how we contribute to building the African development momentum. We do not pretend to have all the solutions to the challenges of our continent, or even just South Africa. But we take our responsibility in this regard very seriously. We have a very strong franchise. We are the bank in almost all of the markets that we are in. In most of the markets, we are in the top three. We are well capitalized and we enjoy the support of strong and reputable shareholders who are excited about our strategy and what it has delivered so far. By all accounts, you could say our destiny as a bank is firmly in our own hands. It is with this in mind that we feel confident that we can make a very clear commitment to our continent. A commitment that involves our expertise, our assets, financial investment, our employees' time and skills, and our partnership across all of the areas of our business. Our value of stewardship, the commitment to leave our communities better than we found them, is the lifeblood of the way in which we are doing business now and in the future. We are calling this strategic commitment shared growth. We've chosen just three areas of contribution. These are education and skills training across our markets and the continent, enterprise development, and financial inclusion. While well, we're investing 1.4 billion rand over the next three years in education and skills training across our continent. Through our banking divisions and together with our clients and partners, we are raising 1.3 billion rand in small and medium-sized enterprise financing during 2016, so during this financial year alone. And we enable convenient access to financial services, value-added products and services with about half a million consumers on online digital. By the end of this year, we aim to have given some 350,000 people access to various forms of accredited training and injected 237 million rand into education. This includes university and secondary school funding. It includes and includes bursaries. And when we launch Shared Growth next week to our partners across Africa, we will provide more details on this commitment. Thank you.